In this video I'm going to show you how to solve equations using the Casio FX991 ES Plus. This calculator has a mode built in that makes it very easy to solve these equations. To access it you press mode followed by 5 and then this puts up this menu that shows you all the different types of equations that the calculator can solve. If we choose option 3, this is the one for the standard form of a quadratic equation, we get asked for three coefficients a, b and c. So if you compare um, your equation that you want to solve with the standard form ax squared plus bx plus c. So in this example we've got 2x squared plus 2x minus 12. Compare with this equation, so we get that a is 2, b will be 2, and c is minus 12. So just put this into this calculator, so press 2 equals, then put in b, 2 equals, and c is minus 12 equals. Press equals again, and it solves it. So it tells us that x1 is 2. Press equals again, it gives us a second solution, which is minus 3. In this case, there is two solutions, but we don't always have two solutions. So if we do another equation, so let's look at 2x squared plus 4x plus 2, just in exactly the same way. Put that in, we've got 2 equals, 4 equals, and then 2 equals again. This time we only get one solution, because if you do the b squared minus 4ac from the quadratic equation, this equals 0, which tells us there's only one solution. So don't get surprised if you only get one solution. And just to clear this, I usually do mode 1 followed by pressing mode 5. So I go out of it and back in. So I'll go back to 3 and do the last example, 2x squared plus 2, 2x plus 7. So I'll put this in here, 2 equals, 2 equals, 7 equals, equals again. And this gives us a complex solution, which is exactly what we expect. And if you press equals again, it gives you the negative, which is the other solution. And if you want to get out of this mode, just press mode and then 1. If you want to get out of any calculator mode, usually mode and then comp gets you back to where you are. So there you have it. That's how you solve equations. It's very easy to do. And in future videos, I'll show you how to use some of the other modes to solve different equations. Thank you for watching.